Now, a subject that frequently arises on video hosting sites that allows feedback are haters and trolls. And by those, I don't mean people that you know, disagree with your point of view or argue with you, which is perfectly fine. I just mean those users out there that hide behind blank accounts and just try and insult you, put you down, and just generally make everybody's experience a little miserable. Now don't just laugh at this and shrug this off, because it's actually a serious issue. Now, a lot of users, especially new ones, are actually intimidated by the hater comments and stop posting or don't even start posting videos because they're afraid of all the negative feedback out there. And even more routine users have been driven away from posting videos because of all the hate they receive. My channels don't generally suffer from hater comments and that is because I follow a certain anti-hater strategy which I will introduce to you now. Most likely already fairly well known by the time of its inception, Pipistrello actually coined the term RID in which R-I-D each stand for a different word. Now, RID stands for Recognize, Ignore, Delete, and follows those simple steps. Step 1. Recognize a hater comment for what it is. Maybe it's just someone disagreeing with you, perhaps it's just a misunderstanding. You know, if you're not entirely sure, send that user a private message asking for clarification. Always stay respectful until it's sure that you've actually come across a hater comment, but usually you can be fairly sure. Step two, ignore. This is also known as don't feed the trolls. Don't respond to the comment, don't mention the hater or the comment or any of the feedback in one of your videos. Don't give them any feedback because that's just the attention they're looking for. If you do respond to a comment, make sure it just serves to make the hater look ridiculous and shuts them up. That's the only way to deal with it. Usually if a hater is ignored, they won't come back again because they're easily bored. Step 3. Delete. Especially if the comment is insulting or derisive or vulgar towards you or your friends you shouldn't let it stand up there it's your video you know delete it if somebody taped a sign saying kick me on the back of you and you notice it you take it off you don't leave it on and walk around with it what the hell just delete the hater comments because you see haters like to hide in masses like if you already have 20 hater comments on your video, which you haven't deleted, it's more than likely you'll get more hater comments. But haters are kind of afraid to post the first hate comment. Actually, those three simple steps will pretty much rid you of most haters. Now, if you get any repeat offenders, you block them. You can do it very conveniently right on the comment you can say block user, and you do that. Then they won't bother you anymore. So here's my own take on RID, right? If I get any hater comments on a video, I look through them and usually delete them without a second thought. But if there's a particularly lame or stupid one, you know, one that leaves them wide open to be made fun of, I take that opportunity. I respond to the comment and own the hater, which makes them look stupid, and you look good. Uh, and if you're in a particularly bad mood, you can just block the hater and they can't even respond to that. Uh, and don't have any pity on the troll now. They brought this upon themselves by attacking you on your own turf. You're allowed to defend yourself. Now, any future haters coming to your video will see how their predecessors have been owned and will be anxious to post a hater comment of their own. I actually see it as my personal interpretation of the medieval tradition of decapitating criminals, putting their heads on spikes and proudly displaying them on the
parapets as a future warning for anyone else. So that's my personal take on the anti-hater issue. Now, if you know anyone who's got problems with haters or who's got questions about RID or RID, just refer them back to this video or the original video by Pipistrello, which I will post this as a video response to below. If there are any additional questions, just drop me a PM and I'll be glad to help you out. Just remember, don't feed the trolls and help keep the tube clean. Bye-bye.